Topaz Labs is excited to introduce AI Gigapixel, a standalone batch processing application for Mac and Windows. AI Gigapixel uses revolutionary AI technology to accurately and realistically enlarge your images while keeping your subjects and image details tack sharp. AI Gigapixel can be used to enlarge full-size images, to create larger prints, or to upscale your older low-res image library into full-resolution files you can actually use. Using AI Gigapixel is simple and straightforward. Once you open the application, you'll be given a window to drag images into. You can also click this window to open a file browser, then select and open your images. Once opened, your images will list in the left side of the interface, with a thumbnail and a file path to their location. You can click the trash can icon to remove images from the queue, or double click any of the images to open in your default photo viewer. On the right side of the interface, you'll see new options for batch processing your images. The first section is the Enlarge Options section. This is where you can set your upscaling options in AI Gigapixel. You can enlarge by scale, which will scale your images to set increments of 150%, 200%, 400%, or 600%. You can also enter any custom scale value ranging from 20% to 600%. You can also enlarge by size, which lets you input a custom value to size your image by width, height, or width and height, also by pixels, inches, or centimeters. The width and height option effectively creates a box that your image will scale to fit within. Your images will never be cropped. When you scale them, they will retain their original aspect ratio. You also have the option to enhance your images, which will add post-processing to your image to reduce noise and generally improve the quality of low-quality input images. The Output Format section determines the file types your processed images will be saved as. You can select JPEG, TIFF, or PNG, with additional options for image quality, color profile, or, if you're using TIFF, bit depth. You can also select to match the input format, which will keep your processed images the same file type as your input images. Additionally, you can select whether to apply these settings to raw images only, or to all images processed. Please note, if you're processing raw images, you do need to select a format here. Gigapixel cannot output a raw file type. The output name and location settings let you choose where to save your images, and how they'll be named. By default, images are saved back to their source folder with the suffix underscore output added. By unchecking the Save to Input File Location checkbox, you can specify a custom location to save your images to by clicking the Browse button. You can enter a custom prefix or suffix for your processed images by typing in the provided fields. And you can also check a box to preserve metadata for your upscaled images. However, this will result in slightly slower processing. Once you have the settings you'd like for your batch, you can click the Start button, and AI Gigapixel will begin working through your image queue. It'll show a blue progress bar on each image as it processes, and a green checkbox once the image is complete. You'll also notice under the file location is the dimensions for your image's original and processed sizes. Clicking on any of the images in your queue once they're processed will show you a preview of your processed image in your system's default photo viewer. And getting started with Gigapixel is just that easy. We hope you enjoy the results with this awesome new product.